three days out stay. Only three. Uh, the last one out. I can't do it. No more. No more? No. Oma, Oma, Oma. Oma's a great kid, you know, and I say kid because he's 24 and I'm 38, so to me he's a kid. He's just in Oma world sometimes. Oma world? How does Oma world look like? In the I, I don't think anybody knows what Oma world is, or he's the only one that's in that world. He's that little koala who sleeps all the time, but... I haven't seen much of him because he's been stuck to my back wheel like his job was, you know, and I didn't expect him to still be there, and there he was, again, offering me help, offering what do you need, what do you need, you know, and... Okay, yo, man, this one for that, take first this one. Yeah, Omar is, Omar is a special guy, that he, for him, the, the life is every, every time funny, so also racing is funny for him. I think it was almost before Christmas uh, uh, of 2016. He was in the depot team, but something happened, and uh, internal problems, so, and then he was out of the team. And he was already uh, almost uh, abandoned his career, no? And then he explained me a little bit what happened. I said, okay, I can give uh, a new option for him. It's just to bring back to the Basque country, to my home, and I will put in a, a depot team or under 23 team from the Basque country that I know they are uh, good, uh, I mean, the, how they work and everything, and we see how is the next uh, three months in, on summer, and also I will be with him, he will come, yes, also to play with my son, the PlayStation and everything, also to have lunch or, or dinner, and, and we talk a lot, we talk a lot, I explain to him, uh, yeah, if you want to be a rider, you know, how is going to be your life, no, and everything, and also, he did very good result, it's true, he won a race, it's not easy to, to win an under 23 race in, a, in the Basque country, it's, the level is very, very high. And yeah, it was very, very great moment for him, no? בשבילי גאנטור זה, זה מירוץ של החיים, זה, זה מלחמה, זה ממש מלחמה. אין ימים קלים, כל יום זה פול גז. פתחתי את הגוף לקצה, כאילו חפרתי עמוק, ראיתי שאני מסוגל להיות שם, אז אני חושב שזה שינה לי את הגוף, גם רגליים יותר גדולות, יותר חזקות, גוף יותר חזק, יכול לעמוד ב... צווים בעומסים יותר גדולים. להגיד שאני ווינר, אני עדיין לא ווינר. אני צריך עוד לשפר את הכוחות שלי ולשפר את היכולות שלי באמת. אבל uh, ככה הקריס פורום לדוגמה התחיל בתור דומסטיק uh, והוא הצליח להביא ניצחונות אז אני באותו סטייל של uh, רכיבה אני לא ספרינטר, אני לא מטפס את האור, אני עושה הכל טוב ואני פשוט uh, עם כוח אז אני חושב שככל שיהיה לי יותר כוח בסופו של דבר אני יכול להביא ועם המומנט אני אוכל להביא הרבה ניצחונות He's a great kid and, and I think, you know, physically he's pushed himself incredibly hard in this, in this Vuelta, he's learnt a lot and I think what it'll do for him in the future will be, uh, be some great things, you know, he's definitely got a, a big engine and, uh, and a big heart. I think this race is going gonna, gonna to bring him on a lot, it's gonna, he's going to make a big step after this race because he's learned a lot about himself. He thought he was tired, he thought he was tired 10 days ago, <laughs> no and now. He's still in the front group with 50 kilo, 30 kilometers to go, whatever on the climbs, going full gas, and he's like, wow, I guess I wasn't tired 10 days ago, now I'm tired. You know, <laughs> it's, uh, you know and it, I think that's, that's only something that you can learn in a Grand Tour. And I'm excited to see what you can achieve next year. You know, we are using him in a special moment, in a, sometimes in critical moment, 
and I'm very happy with his performance in this uh, Vuelta and for sure that after this Vuelta he will be ready to do any uh, race in the, in the season for the next year. But I love to play, I love to play in the action, in the game, it's me. It's a little bit of a competition, it's a little bit of a competition, and it's a little bit of a competition. Welcome to Madrid!